it's currently 1 51 p.m on monday november 2nd and i'm about to play fall guys Josie just went to take a shower and then i think we're either gonna go to chick-fil-a off campus or just go to the uc and get chick-fil-a here chick-fil-a sounds so good right now Jesse, yeah. it is three o'clock and we're finally going to get food have we decided what we're gonna eat yeah. Yeah. oh well we'll figure it out First meal of the day, we love that. <laughs> yeah, right, 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 right. We're trying Zaxby's. None of us have had it. You made it sound like there's more than two people. I here. know, I realized that after I said that. Hey, <laughs> you ever had Zaxby's before? This is my clothes back there. Girl from high school. <laughs> what? Just chilling back there. But at some point, uh, that will come to your senses. I don't feel that's just but yeah, we're going to Zaxby's. What are you going to get? We don't know. We've never seen the menu. We <gasps> have Zaxby's sauce? No. So we're going to try Zaxby's sauce? Of course I will. Of course we will. Will. we will. We will. Say it with me. Okay. Of course we will. Of course we will. <gasps> green one, no hitbacks. You made me think it was a green light. Change of plans. We can't eat inside Zaxby's, so we're going to Wings, etc. What? We're going to Wings, etc. 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 Extra. I am. Extra. My hair looks dark here. Oh, did you dye it? Why does it look dark? It looked really light the past few days. Um, but yeah. So we'll see how it goes. Mm, big cup. This is what they mean when they say mozzarella sticks. I've actually kind of been craving mozzarella sticks recently. What? These wings look fire. Literally. Yeah. You think you're gonna eat all of them? No, I don't think so. I might though. Reese's Polar Swirl. <laughs> We're at A&W. This probably isn't good. You said a small root beer float? Yeah. <laughs> like maybe a nose smoothie? Small root beer float. Yeah. Small root beer float. Jesse was supposed to get a root beer float. Then you said a but then you saw swirl. that they have other stuff. Yes, please. So now he's getting Which something with Reese's peanut butter cups. Reese's. Reese's? Yes. Attitude. Can I get you anything else? No, that'd be it. We're gonna pay with my ones. Watch this. Yeah. Alright, thank you. Oh, my phone's good. <laughs> we got, Are you ready? We got, We're gonna eat our ice cream with a fork. We got forks for our ice cream. Yellow and my box. <laughs> Why do you look scared? I can go ahead and reach down and get some, so it won't drip. Church time! Are you excited? We're both so tired. What do you mean another vlog clip? I've been vlogging all day. Isn't that how it works? Yeah. <laughs> we got cupcakes. Church just ended. It's a little after eight. Is it good? I didn't put it in my mouth yet. It's in your mouth now. <laughs> yeah, good. <girl. laughs> <laughs> the ice cream's good. Mm. All right, it's 10.30. I'm gonna eat some of this cream cheese ball stuff, edit this vlog, and hopefully go to sleep, but most likely not. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. So thanks for watching. Hey, so my name's Jesse, and I recently came in contact with somebody that had COVID. And Noise. Yeah, so I go to Southeast Missouri State, and basically the protocol that they do here is that they ship us off to a dorm that's currently not available for regular students anymore. So the dorm's name is Deermont, and this is what it looks like right now. It's actually pretty nice. It's got, got then it's fall time right now, so it's got that fall aesthetic with the, the dead leaves and the colorful trees. But it's actually pretty nice. I'm not gonna cap on the outside. The dorm inside, uh, it's kind of rough, so it's rough at certain parts. So Dermot split up in community style and sweet style, from what I understand. And this is kind of what it looks like. It's got a brick interior and got long hallways like this. And it's split up into different wings, you know? So it's like kind of cool. This isn't going to be like a straight dorm tour. It's just going to be an explanation of how COVID, how that, how was handling COVID. Honestly, I think they're pretty hands off and they're doing it just to be doing it. 
They have shit that's still a dorm separated from others, man. They clean it regularly. It's like, it's cleaner than the other dorms, but is it really that clean? I mean, look at these windows. <laughs> but they do require us to quarantine and isolate. If you have COVID, you're required to isolate. But if you're just at risk, they're required to quarantine. So other part of the dorm, it's pretty cool. Apparently, I was just quarantined because I actually, I don't think I had it. I never tested positive, so. But if you isolate, you can't. And But if you isolate, you can't leave the dorm. If you quarantine, you can't. If you're isolated, they bring you food like this every single day. And they fill out a sheet for it. You have to fill out a sheet online and submit on the email, I believe. And it's pretty cool. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Yeah, this is actually relatively nice dorm. It's kind of cool. Except for certain parts. I mean, that's rough. You know? Where people actually, like, lived here and they, like, took, kept it up. It'd be pretty legit. Really shut down a few years before. Before we came here. I came here in 2019. Obviously, it's 20, 2020 now. So, yeah, I mean, it's pretty legit. This little cool area you could hang out with your friends. Do anything like that. It's pretty legit. It goes right out to the main street. So, yeah. I, oh, and here's the A-wing right here. And they, have, they have people who have COVID and people who are quarantined. I mean, people who are isolated and people who are quarantined. There's a difference, a big difference. They're in separate wings. So, that's always cool. And the rooms themselves, they're pretty legit. Because I think, because you can live by yourself. They have, if you're quarantined, obviously you can't be in contact with anyone. So everyone has rooms themselves. They obviously have the space because not everybody has COVID. So there's a lot of empty, empty, empty rooms. I'm not going to show you all the rooms, but I'm just going to show you my room. Give you an idea. This way. This way. So this is the door. It looks like it's like one of those horror movies, like like Jason Voorhees gonna pop over there. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, okay. And here's the dorm. I'm moving out today, so this is kind of what it looks like. Give you an idea. For some reason, you can't flip the phone, so this is gonna have to do. But yeah, it's a pretty legit living situation. It was pretty nice to live by myself. Like, like if I could have this room, except not in the room, not in the dorm, it's extremely cold. Oh yeah, and like the first week and a half to two weeks, the dorm was literally freezing cold. It was like forty-five degrees straight. You literally had to sleep in clothes in the cold. So it's relative. It's very very rough. Rough living, but I'm out now. So yeah. Also, I don't know, I already said thanks for watching, but uh, not gonna that out, kind of funny. The last clip uh, is a clip Jesse took in quarantine that I have yet to watch. So hopefully it's good, it's about four minutes. I'm gonna hopefully add this into the video. Uh, okay, thanks for watching. <laughs>